debates. It's an important debate, and we hope we contribute to it tonight with this report by Ken Kashiwahara on a grade school experiment in Oregon. For these second graders, it was a simple homework assignment. Watch a half hour of children's shows and count the number of incidents of violence, hitting, <laughs> kicking, use of weapons. In 12 hours of programming last January, the kids counted 649 incidents of violence, nearly one a minute. They were surprised. Because I really didn't know there was that much violence on TV. And before, I didn't even know what violence was. After discussing the results, many students decided that the violent programs were affecting their behavior. Sometimes some kids start being violent and stuff. So they decided to do something about it. We are second grade students in room seven. They wrote a declaration of independence from violence. In it, they pledged to boycott the shows and their sponsors, a pledge they have made to the entire student body, to community service organizations, and even to the county board of commissioners. I don't watch as much as TV anymore since all my favorite shows are most of the violent <coughs> shows. Boycotting the shows is proving easier than boycotting the sponsors, which range from fast food restaurants to cereals and candy and fruit drinks. I don't want to buy anything that's on your list. Let's when Jeremiah that. Allen goes shopping with his grandmother, he now takes along a list of the sponsors and looks for alternatives. I found out that there's other products that put the same kind of fruit out and I don't have trouble anymore. But their teacher says boycotting is not what's important. My hope is that the children will have the information to make choices that they wouldn't have had before. Choices made in the second grade. Ken Kashiwahara, ABC News, Springfield.